Welcome to this brief demonstration of a customized solution from Infront Consulting Group. In this demo, we demonstrate our command line executable for updating custom attributes in SCOM from a comma delimited file. Infront has extended the Windows computer class in SCOM with custom attributes for server owner, application owner, application, and location. Our custom application allows us to populate these attributes with values stored in a comma delimited file. As you can see, the attributes are currently empty. Here you can see our Acme Server Inventory comma delimited file. This is the file that contains the asset information for our servers. In the file we have five columns, computer name, which is used to match with a computer in SCOM, location, which is the physical location of the computer, server owner, which is the owner of the machine, application owner, which is the application owner of the machine, and application, which is the primary application running on the machine if applicable. Next, we need to run the update SCOM from CSV executable. To take the contents from the comma delimited file and update the custom attributes in SCOM. As this is a simple command line executable, you can schedule it using Windows Task Scheduler to run at specified intervals, or double click the application to run it when required. I'm going to double click the application to run it. Now that the application is finished running, if we refresh our view in the Operations Console, we can see that the custom attributes have now been populated. If we've scheduled this executable to run on a daily basis using Windows Task Scheduler, then any changes that are made to the asset file on a particular day will be picked up the next time the executable runs and updated in SCOM. We can also see that a file has been created called missingcomputers.txt. This file contains all the computers from the asset file that were not found in SCOM, indicating that these computers are not managed. You can use this list to determine what computers might need to have SCOM agents installed. We hope you have enjoyed this brief demonstration of the Infront command line application for updating custom attributes in SCOM from a comma delimited file. For more information on this and other solutions available from Infront Consulting, as well as our training offerings, please email us at sales at infrontconsulting.com or visit our website at www.infrontconsulting.com.